Hello, this is Jenny from Healing the Wounded Heart. There are probably not many of us who know people who have experienced real hunger or real thirst. I certainly haven't really experienced either of those apart from when I was on steroids whilst receiving chemotherapy. After being given my first steroid dose, I couldn't understand why I suddenly felt so hungry, like I could eat a horse. Whilst undergoing radiotherapy later on, and for a good year or so afterwards, my mouth and my throat felt so very dry that I had to continually drink from a bottle of water and I really couldn't string more than a few words together without taking a gulp of water. Well, thanks to God and to all those who have faithfully prayed for me, I am no longer in that position. But my experience has got me thinking, when was the last time I was really hungry for God and for his word and thirsty for more of him and more of his Holy Spirit in my life? This is a very challenging question to all of us, isn't it? If we are truly honest, I think that we can too easily find ourselves hungering and thirsting after those things which are not particularly soul satisfying. This is probably why Jesus said to his disciples in Matthew chapter 5 verse 6, Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. In other words, when we seek after him and only him, it is then that we receive true fulfilment and satisfaction deep on the inside of us. So why is it then do we still seem to insist on seeking after other things? Is it because of our human nature or because somehow deep down we just don't believe that this really is the truth? Well, the answer is probably, I think, a bit of both. When are we going to get it? Only Jesus truly satisfies the spiritual hunger and thirst that every person has deep down in their lives. So let's be reminded then of another scripture found in John chapter 6 verse 35. Then Jesus declared, I am the bread of life. Whoever comes to me will never go hungry and whoever believes in me will never be thirsty. May God, by his grace, fill us afresh with that deep hunger for him and that thirst for him. God bless you. Amen.